Hey everybody, um, there are probably a lot of people that do not know how to use Lockstrux bot. This is going to be a quick guide on how to get started and use this bot. First, you want to make sure that you register with, with Charlemagne. Um, if someone has already typed in the slash register command, you can just click here, um, link your Bungie account, and it will find the data about your Bungie name, and it will update that to be your username in Lux server. Um, once you have that username, um, then you can start using the bot. So what I want to do is slash Q checkpoint, find an encounter that I want to get a checkpoint for, and then click enter. If you want to see which checkpoints are available, you can do slash checkpoint list. And this will show you a list of all of the checkpoints that we have. Um, so we have Crota, uh, both normal and master. Um, we've got Eerie Ute on master. Um, we've got Warlord's Ruined Boss on normal and master. Um, in Vault of Glass, we have Post Templar and Atheon. Um, if you're coming from the Fallout video and you want to know how to do spoils, you can get four of the secret chests in Vogue from Post Templar without having to do a single encounter. So you can do that fully solo. Um, so check that out. Um, now, how you go ahead and queue a checkpoint. Um, if I want to uh, queue a checkpoint, I can do slash queue checkpoint uh, vault of glass. And then I can just type in post and that will queue the checkpoint for me for post templar. Now what this will do is it will send uh, me into the queue. So if I do slash view queue, I can see my position and see who's out of me. Um, and right now someone's getting Shiro Chi and uh, after they're done getting Shiro Chi, it will invite me to get post templar. So I'm gonna fast forward the video to where I get post templar. All right, before I get that invite, I might as well just show you guys um, how to get uh, checkpoints. So for example, if I want to go to Tanix on Deepstone Crypt, um, I can type uh, Tanix. Um, I can also type boss because it's the boss encounter. I can type four because it's encounter four. Um, other examples, um, if I want to get master Crota, I can do slash Q checkpoint. Um, Crota's end, uh, boss. And then if I want to select a difficulty, I just need to choose this difficulty selector and just enable master. And this would be master Crota. Um, now, a favorite of people is Shirochi. Um, so I would just do last wish and I could just type in two if I don't want to type out Shirochi or worry about misspelling that. Um, so encounter numbers are very helpful here um, and all of the encounter numbers work. So um, make sure you try this stuff out, see what works for you. And uh, yeah, uh, now to the checkpoint. All right, so I just got the invite. Um, now I go ahead and accept that. Um, it will pull me into the fire team. Um, if anybody else also queued up this checkpoint, uh, they will get queued in as well. It'll send a couple messages to you. And after about a minute delay, um, it'll load you into the checkpoint. All right, the bot has just selected the activity and it's launching us in. Um, once it loads me in, uh, it'll leave and it'll be my instance. So um, you don't have to worry about pushing a bot uh, to its death to wipe a checkpoint. Um, any checkpoints that you're loaded in from orbit, uh, it'll automatically transfer that checkpoint to you. Uh, you don't need to worry about wiping the encounter. You just load in from orbit and you're all set. And here I am at post Templar. Um, if I just run back this way, um, I can go get the first two chests. Um, I might as well show that here because um, I'm sure a lot of people want to do that with uh, solo spoils. Um, I recommend bringing Eager Edge for this, um, but you just climb up here. Now, the second secret chest you can get by jumping down there, um, but you can run all the way up this this, uh, this cave and get the first secret chest, and then make your way down to the second secret chest, 
uh, make your way past the uh, Confluxes Oracle Templar area and into the Gorgon Maze, get that chest, and then complete the Gorgon Maze and get Gatekeeper, all without having to do a single encounter. But here we are. Um, I can go grab this. And continue on through the raid. Um, but that's pretty much it for this video. Um, if you have any questions, uh, I'm sure any of the uh, the mods in the Discord should be able to answer your questions. But hopefully this showed you a guide on a little bit how to get started. So um, good luck and uh, thanks for using Lockbot.